not bad. So every once in a while, I'm reminded how frustrating this game could get because I'm over here hitting and a guy is probably 120 yards away in the other fairway and he hit a bad shot and you could just hear him cursing the shot and cursing everything else. I guess this game frustrates some people at times. I rarely play to my expectations, but I just go play golf. Eight iron, 137. Wasn't very good. Let's try to get up and down. But guys, I am definitely not happy with this shot. However, I'm in the front of the green, on the fringe, slash fairway. You're gonna miss the green. This is where you wanna miss it. All I have to do is get the speed right. It's just like a putt. Little high. So guys, I've got the 849D here. I've got it set at a 10.5 and I haven't hit it yet really. So again, let's not uh, pass too much judgment on sub 70 till I get used to hitting these clubs. Okay, feels a little heavy. Heavy to me, we'll get it worked out. Okay, we're a little right of the fairway here. Back right pin, 122 yards. Wind's helping a little bit and going right to left. I'm gonna go with the, with the nine iron here. Little left, but I hit that pretty solid. Exactly pin high, little left. I didn't hit it really hard because I knew it wasn't a real full nine iron. Little left to right here. Oh, that was a good stroke. Wow. Now that one felt good. That one felt really, really good. So the ball mark is pretty much where the camera was. So it flew about five yards, well, four yards short of this. I've got 120. So I look like I carry that ball in the two, 218 range, something like that. 120. Go with a nine yard again. It's middle of the green. Quite a few in between shots so far. The taper light 95s in this, I can, doesn't feel quite as heavy. That head on that driver feels heavy to me. This has a really, really good feel in the irons. It's kind of what I'm used to. That left again, but kind of on an uphill slope. God, I didn't catch that ball quite as flush. But miss hit, we're on the green here, 25 foot range. Like I said, keep it in front of you, especially when you miss hit it a little bit. Ball should break a little to the right. Through August 2nd, Golf Ball Planet is running a midsummer restock special. You can save 15% and get a free mystery dozen by using the code MIDSUMMER. Back to the video. Really like the feel of this 006 putter. So guys, one thing I learned, you know, is some holes you just can't you just can't try to beat them. You know, this hole, every time I try to be a little more aggressive, it costs me. So we're just gonna play it as a three-shot hole. It's 380. It's out of bounds right. There's water if you go too far down there left. I'm just gonna hit a four hybrid, and I've never hit this hybrid, but set at standard KBS 70 Tor Graphite Iron, regular shaft. This is the 949X. Hit 
tad bit of fade, but not bad. Now, guys, I don't know if this is supposed to be forgiving, but you can see I hit this ball well out on the toe and still in the fairway. So actually, this went a little further than I thought it would. Have a little bit of mud on the ball here. We've only got 176 to the front, but we kind of have a little bit of this tree in the way here. I think I may try to hit that four hybrid again. Just take it out at the uh, left side of the green, left of this tree. And as long as I carry that creek, which is only about 150 to carry here, I should be safe. So let's do that. So basically, I kind of want to hit the same little shot I just hit. I'm not really trying to work the ball with a club that I've never hit before. <laughs> well, I got away with that one, guys. Wow. So, guys, it's a perfect time to talk about game plans. I hit that shot, and I obviously hit it really thin, went under the tree branch, probably landed 40 yards short of this green and rolled up here. And you notice I had a game plan on the tee, but once I had a shot, then that game plan changed. So having a, a backup plan, if I get past that tree and I'm in the fairway, well, now that's when you have to think about whether you could go for it or not. If I was behind the tree or if I was in the rough, I would have just hit back to a wedge. Punch and move to the right, and it's off the fringe. That's not moving. Now it's moving. A long time to move. So, guys, we have about 168 here, and I say about because someone didn't put the flag in. So, I kind of got it, I kind of have a gap. I don't have a five hybrid, I have a four, and then the next would be that six iron. So, I'm going to go ahead and hit this four hybrid and hit it back towards the middle of the green or even back of the green would be fine. Huh. That's long. That's it's well long. Gosh, his head just feels so much heavier than what I'm used to. I'm going to play this a little safer out to the right due to that because I'm having a little trouble getting around on this club. I'll go with the 9 iron. Oh boy. Just played away from the tree there. Trees hang out so far, it's hard to just put something in the front of the green, you gotta make sure you carry the trees. That's an error. One eighty guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and go with the four hybrid. Next club is a three wood, so I don't have a much of a choice. Oh. work on these settings guys 130 back pin so I have to go with the nine iron here kind of pulling them guys not a bad shot though okay so we have a left to right breaker here this ball is pretty much pin high maybe flew 127 or so
Okay, guys, last hole. See if we can get a good drive on this one. Okay, guys, so lie is not bad. 167 to the pin. I do have a six iron in my back, so I'll hit a little low one, hopefully hooking with that. I got the right side of the green, so if it goes straight, still okay. No good. All right, guys, a little shot here of about 40 yards or so. Tricky little right to left putt here. It would have been better to leave it short of the hole. Not enough break. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, like, comment, subscribe. Until next time, Mr. Short Hitter, out. Five holes to go, just play 13.